All right, well, the guy, the guy that I get to bring up right now is uh, one of my very, very best friends. I got started with this guy about five years ago. I met him in the gym, and uh, we just kind of hit it off right away, and we've been just grinding this thing out, and I'm just super, super proud of him. Uh, I mean, one of the defining moments, I think, of, of my business was a direct impact or from this guy. It was about, about a year and a half ago. I was at a very, very low point in my life, and I was just, I didn't, I was there, but I wasn't really, you know, there, and we had a big event coming up, and I didn't really feel like I wanted to go, and this guy, he's on, he's in my team, so what, what I do really has nothing to do with him, and I'm just, I'm so grateful for this guy, because uh, that one event, he actually, you know, he paid for me to go, he just kind of drug me along, and that was actually the event of Breckenridge about a year ago that pretty much changed everything for me in the last 14 or so months, and I can promise you I wouldn't be up on this stage if it wasn't for my buddy. I mean, he's one of the most relentless, tenacious guys that I've ever met in my life. I mean, he's just been, um, you know, he's always seeking to grow. He's always seeking to develop himself, always what can he do better to better his team. And it's just so awesome just being able to watch this guy rise in the ranks right now and actually get to go on the, the next R&B trip with him. And I just, I can't say enough great things about this guy. Super, super proud of him. So if you guys can please help me welcome to the stage my man, Mr. David Townsend. <laughs> Oh man, <laughs> this is uh, this is amazing for me. This is my fifth view. Um, r raise your hand if you've ever felt like you know, you're, or like your mind is just telling you that you you can't do this. Anyone ever feel like that? That's how I felt my first time uh, when I got involved in uh, you know the first event that I went to. I had so many things that were telling me, you know, my mind just kept going through all the different reasons why I couldn't do this. I was, I was too young. I started at 19. I was going to college at the time, and um, I was, you know, I didn't have enough credibility. I didn't, I didn't know the right people. No one would listen to me. I mean, I had so much crap going through my head when I first got started as to why I couldn't, I couldn't be one of, these, one of these guys walking this stage. And I went to my first training almost five years ago. And uh, for the first time in my life, I finally had hope. You know, hope that I could, I could live that life that I always wanted and dreamed of, but never really thought was possible or in the cards for, for me. And uh, I went to that event, and I made a commitment to pretty much go to every other event. And they taught me how to believe in myself. They, they, taught me, they taught me how to make no excuses and to just do it. If I wanted it, to just do it. So about almost five years and about 60 trainings later, I'm finally starting to live that life that I had wanted. Anyone can do this. Anyone can do this. I promise you that. And it's so funny because now it's not about me anymore. It's about the people that I love. It's about my family. It's about people like Anna. It's about people like, you know, my, my baby sister, my little sister, she's 22. And she was born with a really rare liver disease that almost killed her. Spent her first two years of her life in the hospital. And she's 22 now and she can't hold a regular job because she gets sick so often that she has to go to the hospital a lot. And her boss doesn't like it when she ends up going to the hospital randomly and has to spend a week there and she can't work. So I get to go to war for her to make sure that she never, ever, ever has to show up again to a job she doesn't like. She, she can own her life. And not just her, but thousands. We're going to change the lives of thousands so that they can all own their lives like we start to get to own our lives. I ask you to join us on that crusade to go be a life changer, a box cutter. If you want to be a box cutter, if you want to make a difference, decide. Just go do it. It doesn't matter how old you are, what your background is. It does not matter. You saw a lot of people this year or th th at this event walking stage from all sorts of different backgrounds. Anyone can do it. I promise you, if I can do it, anyone 
can do it. Just make the decision today that you're going to be a life changer. Make no excuses. Just go make it happen. Thank you. Woo! So good.